Satish Gujral left India to go to the West to study painting further, but rather than going to Europe, he actually, in 1952, went to Mexico. And so his works, at least from this period, there aren't that many, were heavily influenced by Mexican themes and motifs, and also certainly communist, the communist leanings of his friends. After he returned to India, he, his experimentation led him into other directions. I did not come to a painting partition with intention. It just came out of me. Much later, a critic explained that I painted a partition, not because I was affected by it, but because that pain lived in me, and I, I chose partition. I was not painting for my others. I was painting for myself. I do not think. I think, I believe an artist is not a thinker. He is a feeler. He cannot explain in words. I have seen part of those days during my visit to the United States. And I saw those tools you do from it changed in form and color. I think uh, the main thing was that he wanted to create movement around him. He hasn't been able to hear after the age of nine. And he hated to be in the stillness. And he wanted to create a new environment each time. So he got bored a couple of you know, worked in a medium for a couple of years and then wanted to discover a new style or a new expression. And I enjoy and admire him still for that, that he is able to, you know, set his imagination free. <laughs>